Namaste. Today I'm starting a new series, a new line of work in the area of crystalline structures. I have had many years of experience with crystals, minerals, and substances of earth. I have read the Judy Hall Bible 1, 2, and 3 quite thoroughly, and though I may be a bit rusty on a few areas, I'm going with what I know and what I've got. So, to start it all off, this is basically one of the first crystals I personally got on my journey of this area. Lapis Lazuli is considered to be a stone, although the three components are crystalline. There's the blue azurite, which is similar to malachite, white calcite, which helps to clear the mind, azurite helps to have the creativity of the mind, and pyrite, the little gold flecks, help to bring it into life without obstruction or interruption. I have this trusty little page that they give out at some of the shops. Lapis Lazuli corresponds with the throat chakra, third eye, inner truth, inner power, love, intuition, cleansing, positive magic, Manifestation, friendship, bonds, relationships, confidence, protects against psychic attack, stress relieving, brings self understanding, self awareness, heightens creativity, clarity, and speaking your truth. I personally benefit from holding this Lapis Lazuli piece when making decisions about the future. There was a myth of Cleopatra holding Lapis Lazuli when making decisions on the way into war or battle or progression in life generally. They would also work with some crystalline minerals within their makeup, sometimes toxic, though sometimes beneficial, in the aid of messages of the gods and the result. Uh, result. Lapis Lazuli is also great for dream work. It helps with understanding and comprehending the dreams, keeping positive dreams, keeping like a bad dream catcher. It'll just, if anything's trying to give you a bad time, it'll give them their own medicine and help them to understand and go through it themselves so they may heal and progress thoroughly. As is one of the beneficial attributes known to be associated with Lapazuli, it will protect from psychic attack or protect from ill intent or ill wishes. 
by sending it back until they learn themselves a better way. Lapis Lazuli teaches the power of spoken word is beneficial in relieving headache and there's a myth of the Lazuli that they will often be known to disappear if the holder or wearer becomes unworthy in some way or another. One of the most common crystals to disappear is one I've had since the beginning. And the goddess of that stone is of positivity with the worthiness of the goddess she will guide your way also quoted from the book the physical healing benefits of the geomagnetic field of lapis lazuli list geomagnetic being the orb the vibe of the stone this is how crystal elixirs are made with water and the sorts. Healing. Lapis Azumi alleviates pain, especially that of migraine headaches. It overcomes depression, benefits the respiratory and nervous system, and the throat, larynx, and thyroid. Cleanses organs, bone marrow, thymus, and the immune system. Lapis lazuli overcomes hearing loss, purifies blood, and boosts the immune system. It alleviates insomnia and vertigo, and lowers blood pressure. Position. Where or place at the throat or third eye. Lapis lazuli should be positioned above the diaphragm, anywhere between the sternum and the top of the head. Lapis lazuli is often easily and readily available to find or purchase, though may be expensive. It is a high class and well renowned stone Positively one of the best in my books, or not to favoritize, though I, like I said, have carried along my whole journey in the crystal area of work. Also, a side note, I've heard speculation, whether that be conspiracy or factual, that this planet is one of the most diverse of the crystal variety in our collective cosmos. Hence, maybe a hint to the importance of this world and us being here now together. Thank you for joining. I hope you enjoy. Please feel free to drop a like share a comment if you have anything to add anything that you could benefit more any questions or your own experiences thanks for joining all the best into the next namaste and internal peace